Hey guys, welcome to Fear and Wine. We're starting here a new LP. This is the Callisto Protocol, the DLC Final Transmission. So initially we have we're doing this as a full blown let's complete. We're gonna just run through it because I think it's only like three or four hours long. But when I was doing it, I don't know. I did it one when I was fucking going through food poisoning, so I ended up just like stopping in the middle of it and then I erased it. But I figured, fuck it, I'll just do a let's play of it. I mean, just, it's going to be like, what, six fucking parts? So it's not that long. And, you know, I want to take my time with it rather than rushing through it to make time to where it's not a super long one. And I haven't really had it in me to do fucking let's completes anymore. It's just too much, too much time has to go to it. But anyway, yeah, this came out. Uh, I can't, I don't really know when it came out. I don't feel like it was that long ago. So I to get it. Uh, hopefully it's starting from the beginning. If not, we'll have to uh, redo this whole thing and I'll have to go race to save data. Because, yeah, like I said, we played it and we went made it a little into it. But let's see. See if it gives us a cutscene. But, yeah, so this is supposed to be taking place after uh, the Callisto Protocol ended. So if you played the game, great. Then you kind of understand where it's starting from. If you did not, this is going to be massive spoiler territory, so, uh, you know, your discretion is advised. And don't believe what everyone tells you, that uh, this game is actually pretty good. It's actually really good. It's not Dead Space, and, and if you're trying to sit there and compare the two, then you're going to be disappointed, because they're not the same game. Max has been on my case about these Sweet. Europa runs. Alright, I'm going to shut the fuck up there in this. Before. Don't know why he cares so much now. Mayday, Mayday, Mayday! This is UJC Caron! Return it to Callisto! Hold on! Please turn it back! Grab him, too. Uh, hey! What are you doing? Hey! I didn't do anything! Dr. Caitlin Marler, an Asper Article 412 of the UJC Penal Code, you will now be fitted with a core device. <laughs> What is going on? Right there, I just saw something. It attacked me and it, it didn't seem human. There was an outbreak 75 years ago. Just like what's happening in the prison. They killed everyone. I'm trying to contain it. Everyone. These aren't accidents. There's a pattern. Arcus, Black Iron, Europa. Then about escape, Jacob. So what's it about? Not anymore. What's it about? Answers! Soon everything will become clear. Your core is linked with hers now. Or at least it will be once the sink is complete. Europa wasn't a terrorist attack. Jacob, what do you got there? What we got here is none of our business. But come on, we got a job to do. I could have stopped this, but I didn't. What about you? I played my part in all of this as well. There's no escape for me. Black Iron is where I belong. Late on time. He approaches the survivor. Just give me the goddamn antidote. I'm not gonna let her die. You're not the innocent you claim to be. You've proven that you'll do just about anything to ensure your own survival. Yeah, like I said, massive spoilers to show you the whole game. But choice. Uh, every choice in your life has led you here. To this moment. To this place. Jacob. There might be a way out after all. But I'm going to need your help. I am glad that Welcome they to Black Iron Prison. They didn't leave this like as a setup for a close to protocol two they made a dlc for it um i do think it is kind of lame when they they saved the true ending for dlc that you have to pay for but you know in this day and age it's not that abnormal jacob can you hear me wake up jacob uh, 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 what 
Where the fuck am I? It doesn't matter. Just get moving. My lab's up ahead. I'll explain there. Alright, here we go. Oh yeah. Whoa. Watch out, bitch. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh, no. Ah, good, he's not gonna transform. Shit. A little rusty here. Oh. Ooh, swing and a miss. Uh oh. Alright. Got that shoddy. Move, Jacob. I'm moving, woman. Okay. Oh, yeah, I need to remember we have the grip. Don't have auto aim. I'm so used to auto aim from Resident Evil 4. <laughs> Shit. Doesn't have auto reload either. I actually kind of like Resident Evil. Resident Evil's all you had to manually reload, so. We got some assholes in here, cool. Ooh. Alright. Alright, L1 is to run. I keep pressing R uh, L3. That is L1. If you're not familiar with the game, when those tentacles come out, that means they can transform into something more difficult to kill, so you want to blast that thing, or take them to the ground and stomp it so they don't turn. Oh shit. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. <laughs> Ooh. Oosh. Fuck out. Uh, my aim, my aim will get better, I think. <laughs> Anybody who's watched these streams throughout the years know that my aim sucks in games. <laughs> what happened to Ferris? Why can't I remember how I got here? Dissociative amnesia. Uh. Your mind is protecting itself. Just hurry. I promise everything will become clear soon. I guess he experienced that much trauma that his brain just shut it down. Oops. Wait, which which side am I going out of? This way? Yeah. It's nice to come back to this game, I gotta tell you. I mean I, I think I finished the other one like four or five months ago. The actual LP for the game. The door to my lab is so. offline. You'll need to open it from there. Okay, we're gonna need a fuse. Oh. This game's got a lot of cool details, you know? Oh, we got an industrial fan there. Oh. Back. Oh, this is a decoder. Sell that to get some credits. Is that space over there? No. And there's a fuse. Of course. Oh, I 
Oh, man. All right, let's heal up. We took quite a beating in that fight. Yeah, I need to use that grip, man. I gotta remember that I have the grip and that it's a useful tool. Could have grabbed one and threw him. And there was a lot of enemies in there, more than three, so... Transform it! Oh shit. Yeah, that's them transformed right there. Okay. Don't get too close. You can easily just get pulled in there and die. So let's not do that. Sometimes they throw that third swing. Sweet. Okay. Let's get back there and put in the fuse. Do we have any more health? No, we do not. We need to get some... Uh, Whenever we go run to a store, we need to build some uh, health injectors. Okay. What the hell happened here? An explosion. I right, let's see what's in here. Set the system. Oh shit. Oh, I have like one second left. <laughs> I don't know. I probably would just reset it and I have to do it again. I was taking a sip when that happened, so I was like, oh, I'm already behind. Makes any sense? It's just your mind playing tricks. You've been through a terrible trauma. And, and what about you? There's no escape for me. What changed? You did. I saw what you were willing to do. I regret what I've done, but we have to keep fighting. We have to finish this. Now listen. There's an escape ship waiting for us. Get to the loading bay, and I'll meet you there. Yeah, and then what? Why don't we just fly out of here? We're the most important cargo of all. I've downloaded all of my files to a series of drives. The first one's there. You'll find others along your way. You gave Danny a piece of the puzzle. 
puzzle, but recover them all, and we can expose Cole. Put a stop to his plans. Hmm. Right, one last job. And fine, I'm in. Okay. What is that thing? It held one of my experiments. It broke free when systems failed. Avoid it if you can. Fight it if you must. Great. You're right. One last job. Cool, we're gonna have something like a regenerator or the thing from Dead Space that just kept regenerating. So it's funny, like, so, you know, after playing Resident Evil 4, which when this is released, it won't make sense because Resident Evil 4 will still be going on, but this is all streamed out of order. Uh, you know, the regenerator there, like, can be killed. When you think about the one in Dead Space, you literally had to freeze it in front of a fucking jet engine to kill it. Like, it truly was indestructible. Um, I'm glad that they didn't do that with Resident Evil 4 because that enemy was a piece of shit. I mean, it was terrifying. It was a scary enemy. When it showed up, it was like, all attention goes to that. And I'm glad they didn't throw him in the middle of you fighting other people. Well, I guess they did one time, but you could run. Yeah, because he had to, you know, use the, a rifle with the scope that would be able to read the bugs on it. That kind of thing. Oh. Great. Uh-oh. Is that his, uh, co-pilot? Yes. Elias. It's Elias. Oh, sweet. My boy. Hold on. What's in here? Sorry, Elias. I gotta go the opposite of where you're going, because there's usually power-ups. But there's not. Oh. Hey. He said there's a power-up where you were. Wait. Huh? What? Oh, fuck me. Oh, hooray! Caught in a loop. It's always fun when you have an unreliable narrator. What is this? Oh, shit. Still seeing things. Your mind is still recovering. Hallucinations are to be expected. That's Just a brutal hallucination. Moving. Like, in my time of, uh, drug use, you know, hallucinations I've had, uh, you know, but luckily I was never in a terrifying situation where hallucinations can equal death. <laughs> and they've never been that vivid. They're just usually like, ooh, the walls are breathing. Oh, shit. Alright, cool store. Sell oh, some of the stuff. I don't. I don't want to use the skunk gun. I don't give a shit about that gun. Uh, but let's let's sell decoder. Okay, so we got four spots. Oh, boom! Boom! I had alternate fire that fires explosive rounds. Oh yeah, now we can like fully, fully upgrade our weapons because there was like not enough time to do it in the original. Sweet. Fuck yeah, dude. Uh, oh yeah, let's buy some, uh... Skunk gun, uh... Alright, what's this one? Upgrades the weapon, which explodes shortly after impact. Okay, another explosive one. Okay. Oh, what then? What about these? 700. That's oh shit, god damn it. I need to build the... Oh, there. Health injection. Let's make two of them. 
So I do. I want to start saving up my points a little bit to uh, upgrade all the weapons. Just have to be careful. So I think alternate fires are one. If that's what it said, I wasn't reading it. Cause that's what I do. Oh. Oh, and another health injector. Sweet. One for free. Oh come on, you pieces. That's a dangerous stab. <laughs> I mean, granted, he's wearing armor, but still. It's like you're just, like stabbing towards your face. Get down. Oh, shit. Oh, that's it. Don't let it see you. A biobot. Are you fucking kidding me? We mixed a robot with a fucking a human being? What is wrong with y'all? Jesus. Oh, this fucking sucks. So it's like hiding from the robots, but worse. Yeah, in case y'all haven't played close to protocol, there is robots in the game, like sentry, like kind of security bots, and uh, they can kill you real quick. Look for a way out. Quickly. Okay, so we cannot let this fucker see us. Oh god. Luckily, his perifs aren't very good. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, what's that? CPU printer. Oh, God. Luckily, he's not sound sensitive. I thought that was totally going to just screw me right there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, as interested as I am to see it, what his fucking kill is, looks like, where he just destroys us, uh, I'd rather pass right now. Alright, there's a vent right there. Go, go! Bye! Let's fight it if you must, so there must be a way to fight the damn thing. What is that? What is it? Oh shit, that's a schematic. Hold on, we need to drop something. Oh yeah, shit, it's up on the D-pad. Um, wait, do we need, do we need health? Yeah, fuck, we'll just use one. Oh yeah. Yeah, we need that schematic for sure. The assault rifle schematic. Which is cool, because we didn't get the assault rifle till literally the end of the game. And I would like to upgrade it. See, because I don't even think I upgraded it once, because I didn't have enough points or... Uh... Credits. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Okay. Whatever the fuck that was. <laughs> That's also new. So what is that, like a security precaution for the vents? Because that's a weird one. Okay. Prison, am I right? Oh, 
Oh. Ah, we got. God damn it! Ah! Get off me, you fucker! Ah. Oh! Explosive round. Oh, come on. What the fuck? Oh my god, we're gonna die. God fucking get off me, you fucking bitch. Oh god. Shit. God damn it. Oh my god, there's two of them now. Fuck me. Oh my god, I keep fucking missing. Are you kidding me? Thank you. Oh, no, I... Oh, man. Shit. Oh, it burns up a lot of ammo. Oh, my God. <laughs> that was almost the worst situation possible. <laughs> oh, my man. Come on, dude. Yeah, we're almost out of ammo for this fucking gun now. So, yeah, it's a cool little... It kills him, but, man, you missed. That is just a lot of ammo you wasted. Oh. All right. Dickhead. Oh. That ranged attack. Excuse me. Hey, come on. Oh, don't be shy, man. Come on. Punk ass bitch. Oh, you like attacking people from far away, huh? Ha! Shit, no. No, sir. No, sir. Get the fuck off me. So violent. Alright. Okay, we got a door down here. We desperately need a fuse. Hey! Hey, buddy! Oh! Calm your shit down! Oh, shit! I didn't see that second one. Oh. Oh. God damn it, quit blocking my fucking attacks! Oh my god, come on. Jeez. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, what's in here? Heal up a little bit. Anything else of use? Oh. Health injector, sweet. And another one. That's a good find. Alright guys, well that's going to be the end of part one of our Let's Play of... Oh, hold on. Hold on. Yeah, no, that's going to be the end of part one of our Let's Play of uh, <laughs> the Callisto Protocol Final Transmission. Uh, hope you guys are enjoying this. I'll be back with part two very soon. Until next time, peace.